Okay, um, this will be my second review of the Leo Wines Transgender Underwear, where it's a, um, where it's a gaff, but designed as regular underwear at the same time. Um, I just got my second order in, it's like I said in the last video. The last review I did, I've ordered a size smaller. Um, yeah, because I did order a size smaller because the extra fabric where the crotch meets the butt and to see if it also helped tuck, like, be snugger and everything. Haven't opened, I just barely got it in the mail today, which I was, I was expecting it tomorrow because I was check the shipping and everything to see because it shipped on the 6th and last details it like left the facility like this morning in California around like 2 something in the morning and it's already here so I haven't opened it yet so I don't know what it looks like this is what the packaging comes in yeah so let's do this open it and see what's I just hate opening these kind of packages um sometimes but I'm glad they have these kind of packages because it just makes getting your stuff more securely. Okay, let's see here. This is the receipt. So, yeah, it looks like, yep. Yep, okay. That looks correct. Okay, um, this is what, um, it comes in so this is the packaging it's in so yeah it's kind of cute um, I ordered the red and the royal blue and the lycra fabric um, let's see here and a child's 12, I think it is. The size right under adults, extra, extra small. So I have earned um, three points, three more points. Um, Cause this is a loyalty card, like it shows. Um, And that's the back so I've earned three more points so towards the discount like I explained last time one dollar one point equals one dollar and you get the ten get ten dollars off excluding um, shipping so let's do this yeah here's the label with the sizing so you can see child's 12 it's one size smaller than the adults extra extra small so and it's um right through like the last time she stuck it right through both of them and this is a made to order so um yeah so the tag tag on it. Child's 12. Um, the royal blue. Okay, this is what the royal blue looks like. Front. And this is what the back looks like. Um, I 
That's the back. The red. And this is the back of the red. So yeah, that's the back. And like the last review, I said what makes this different is the crotch area. Okay, here's the crotch area. If you can see how that's sewn in this kind of a pattern. And it's actually, let's see here, in person it's actually darker if I can, yeah, that's what color it is. It's a, actually the blue is darker in person than when it's coming up on the camera. And there's like a foam padding like right in the crotch area. That's what helps to tuck. So here's the um, inside of the royal blue. So that's the inside. It has that. And it's like linings right here. So it's the area from here to here. Um, this area from here to here is where it tucks. So that's what it looks like. Um, I had like one small issue I wanted to mention about my, if you watch my previous video, the forest green. Um, I can show you, yeah. Because right here, how this is sewn, right there, I can see that right here. That came, it was only the elastic part right here came unstitched going right here a little bit. So I had to um, sew that up this morning. So, and I've washed it and worn it twice. So, and the purple's hold, held up, so yeah. And, um, so that's the royal blue. And here's the red. Um, the tag, as you can see, the child's 12, and you can see that, um, here's what the inside looks like. This one, the lining is like a nude or a beige, looks more like beige than nude which they usually call it nude or beige. That's what it looks like. So on the inside, as you can see how it's sewn, it's sewn like this, like that there. So yeah, um, so that's what the red looks like. So it's like, yeah, like that. So it's almost like just regular underwear, except that one part where it tucks. So there's the blue one, as you can see. So it's like that. Um, and with the other pair that was recommended for my size, it was right here, here to here. This spot right here was extra fabric um, right here, which is I'm currently wearing the purple one. So it has that extra fabric. So hopefully this one, these two, doesn't have that extra fabric right here. Then hopefully it still tucks the same and everything. So that's what the royal blue looks like. Here's what it looks like and the waist, like the elastic around the waist and the legs are kind of like, they're shiny, but I'm not, yeah, like if you can see that, there we go. So that's what it looks like, if you can see how that's done, then the red, um, You can, if it will show up, 
There we go. Like that's what it looks like. Move that dog fur. Yeah. There we go. You can see that around the leg. Oh, it's kind of shiny. So yeah. So. And also, if you look right here around the side seam on the waist, it's sewn the same way. And that's how the stitching is. So, yeah. Which I didn't show that on the last video, but that's how all the stitching is on all of them. So, yeah. So that's what looks like and this one is yeah black so on the royal blue so that's what it looks like on the stitching and same thing it's like here that same stitching like that So that's how stitching is, looks, and everything. So, yeah, I just noticed a little bit fraying right there. Just need it. This very quickly. Um, there. Fix that issue there. Um, so that's what it looks like in the lycra the royal blue and the red how it's constructed and what it looks like so look out for the next video on my other channel of what it looks like with me actually wearing it to show how it fits and everything so look out for that video when it's done and make sure you watch the other two videos, the one on this channel and my other channel about the other two colors in one in the size bigger in the adults extra extra small. So make sure you watch that and share it and share those videos and this video is the child's 12 is the sizing so share this video and right now I highly 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 recommend the Leo lines it's the transgendered underwear they have from kid sizing to adult sizing and I highly recommend it as your main underwear for tucking because that's what it's made for and my experience it's the best thing I've ever worn it's the most comfortable it's the best thing it doesn't give any maleness down there and it's so comfortable so comfortable can't even feel anything down there like I don't have male genitalia that's how it feels wearing it and and it looks just like yeah female genitalia that's what the, it looks like and what it look it gives um no bulges or anything and in reality um female genitalia isn't flat so if you think about it that way um how it actually looks it looks like that, like if a girl that has a little more prominent down there, just a little bit, it looks just like that female shape, female genitalia, wearing it. And you're able to have pants fit properly and everything. So I highly recommend this as your main, main underwear. So share this with anyone I mean anyone you may know 
who need something like this or talking of their a trans woman, cross dresser, hermaphrodite, anyone who can benefit from this product, I highly, highly recommend it over every single gap out there, over the homemade method, over the thong style, over everything. So please, please support her and go to Etsy. The link will be down below to her shop and her Etsy shop and buy from her. That would help so that she can continue making more and helping the transgendered community in that way. So share this, like, and please comment your thoughts and everything. Just, I like to hear what you have to say. And the link to the other video of me actually wearing it to show what it looks like will be also in the description below. So make sure to check that out and when it's posted. So frequently like check back so when it's posted you know. The link will be down there.